Good morning. Nathan and Nolan. Oh my. Okay, so this is what it looks like. But this is the lowest set. But I've got the boys with me. Nathan and Nolan are with me. Nathan is already on Christmas vacation. Nolan was supposed to go to school, but he's not feeling well, so I decided not to take him to school. And now we are at his doctor's right now, and we're gonna get him checked out and see what's going on with him. Oh, uh, what do you want? But anyways, I'm feeling kind of sad because usually when I come to the doctor, especially with, hold on. Nathan, can you see what's going on? Okay, so usually um, I asked my dad to come with us because um, he's kind of Nolan's comfort. Nolan doesn't like the doctor and usually um, my dad is really good at calming him down and just taking him out. So I'm a little sad because he's not here. Nolan's comfort is not here. So hopefully he'll be okay with this visit. I'm hoping he doesn't like act up too much or cry too much. So. Okay, so I've already begun packing the boys luggage um, it's not really much I think I might be able to fit all of this with mine and Mike's stuff this right here hold on uh, let me get these off hold on and this luggage right here and it's pretty big but uh, I feel like, here, let me show it. There's a lot of room in this, but I feel like I might pack more of my things. So, um, plus our clothes are a lot bigger and thicker, so I might not be able to fit the boys in here. I think we're going to be gone for the weekend, so... I don't really need to pack that much but at the same time I'm packing like three shoes for myself to try to fit I don't know we'll see I'll figure it out but nah, I'm just gonna end up taking two luggage never mind mm, that is what's for dinner today oh it's still hot can you see the steam coming off of off of it and some egg rolls I think those are has vegetable inside but oh my goodness yum Mike just brought this home but look what's in this one. Oh my god chocolate heaven mm. oh my god yum here's another thing let's see what it is Mmm, they don't look good at all. <laughs> they don't look good at all. Eh, maybe it is. But Mike got that from his work. They truly are brothers, look. Laying the same way. <laughs> okay, so this is what it looks like. But this is the lowest setting. Turn it off. We turn it, oh here, this is how you, this is a dimmer right here so we can make it go brighter. See the brightest. Wow, it's pretty. 75 watt. Okay, that is the brightest. It's super bright in the room. That's the brightest. And then, let me show the low, lowest from afar. And then here's the lowest. That's nice. I like it. Now we got to do it in all the rooms. <laughs> nice. So decorations are still up and good. Nothing disturbed. Lapida is still not here. Uh oh. But I've got the boys with me. And just hanging out with Dad. They both have their little videos on so that they don't act up from being bored. And I'm feeding Nolan because he didn't get to eat breakfast yet. So he's eating while we're 
visiting dad. Who eats pizza at 10.30 in the morning and chicken bake from Costco? We do. Nolan's eating a churro. Yummy. So I ended up getting a new laptop case. My old one was this right here and I absolutely love this because it is in my absolute favorite hue of pink. The only problem with this is it gets dirty so easily and it makes it look dirty. Like right now, I don't know if you can see through this camera, but in person, it just looks dirty. Like it just, I don't like it. So um, I decided to get another one and instead of getting something this light that can get dirty easily, I ended up, I wanted to get black or like a dark gray like this. So I like this. I wish it was this color, but it just gets really dirty and I don't like it. So at least with a darker color, um, like if it were to get dirt like this on it, you won't be able to see it on here. So um, I wanted it to look clean and just not dirty. So um, that's the reason why I got another one. There's absolutely nothing wrong with this. I love everything about it and all the pockets and it protects it, the color and everything. I just don't like that it gets dirty so easily. So I got this off of Best Buy. Um, it's HP brand and it's really actually to be honest it's a better material than this right here better protection obviously because it's not like some off name brand um, I like that it has room in there and it's padded if you can see it um, it fits my mouse pad in there perfectly my laptop with the case on it only has one compartment but it fits everything that I need to fit in there um, and it's also what is it called is that RFID where it um, it protects it from identity theft I guess is that's I guess that's what it's called I don't know what it stands for but I know that's what it is for they have it in a lot of wallets now um, my wallet is like that so like um, I guess because you know people are the bad people are smart nowadays and they can get your information through your wallet so um, a lot of the things now the wallets and stuff like this have that RFID protection on it so this one has it um, I don't have to worry about it because I don't put any like information or any cards or credit cards or anything in here I just have all my um, like uh, the uh, what do you call them like um, just the cables and um, the, hu the extra hubs and extra SD card and stuff like that, my mouse, so I don't have to worry about it, but I absolutely love it. It's not in the color I want, or not in the pink, but it's in the color I do want that I don't want it to get dirty and look dirty. And it's really nice and professional looking, clean looking. And um, yeah, so just wanted to share that. Um, and let you guys know that if you do get a laptop case that's a light color it can get dirty and it looks sloppy and messy and ugly so from now on if i do shop for cases it's going to either be black or like a dark color like this but i i do love this right now good morning you don't look like a happy morning person this is more ice than coffee seriously i swear i don't think i had enough coffee it's more ice look at that see that's not the that's ice it. made it look like it's a full cup mm -hmm. so excited we got our disney tickets um nolan school sold like discounted like really great discounted disney tickets and since nolan is free we only had to pay for tickets for me, Mike, and Nathan. So we got six of them so we can go two times. Obviously, there's blackout dates for us, but um, we already know what days. We're going to go on a Friday and a Saturday. And um, this is going to be our first time taking Nolan to Disneyland. This is going to be Nathan's second time, but the last time we took him was... How old were you? Like one? No. Maybe two. One and a half or two. I don't remember going. He doesn't remember, so it's been a while. The reason why we don't haven't taken him in such a long time is because uh, Disney tickets are freaking expensive, and I feel honestly, everybody could feel differently about it. I don't feel their tickets is worth it. That's why. But since these tickets were really great price, discounted tickets from Nolan School, we decided to get it, and I got 
um, I got it for two days so we'll be able to go twice in a row and like I said Nolan is free so he doesn't need a ticket so these tickets are for me Mike and Nathan so um, we don't get to go here are the blackout dates and we don't get to go till February so we're gonna go on um, a Friday and a Saturday so it works out fine I think the boys have school on Friday but shh I'm gonna take them out that Friday so we can go and enjoy Disney time. So we just gotta wait a couple, a few more months. <laughs> Nathan is watching videos of the Taco Bell's Crunch Wrap. Now he wants a Crunch Wrap from Taco Bell. I bought a Lee sandwich for me to eat for lunch, and Nathan, I'm gonna take him to Taco Bell and get his Crunch Wrap. I've never had it before, but apparently it's supposed to be really, really good, especially with nacho sauce, nacho sauce, nacho cheese. So he's gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and buy him that. I'm gonna take a little bite just to see what all the hype is about. And Nathan is, I mean, Nolan is super, super picky with food. So I'm gonna get him some fries. So he'll eat the fries. So um, yeah, we have three different things for our lunch. I get Lee's sandwich, Nathan will get the crunch wrap, and Nolan gets fries. So <sighs> I'm hungry now. <laughs> I need more coffee, the least coffee. They totally cheated us. It's mainly ice. I barely got any coffee. Oh my God. Ugh. I need more coffee. Ooh, look at my view. I get to look at some hot firemen. But what are they doing? Are they trying to rescue somebody? There's no nobody there. Mm-hmm, do your work. Man, do your work, you sexy fireman, you. <laughs> Nathan's looking at me weird. What? What's wrong with looking at them? There's nothing wrong with looking with some sexy fire hot fireman. <laughs> Nathan's like totally making a face at me. Mm -hmm. If only I can get this thing closer. Look at that. Oh my gosh. I can't even explain. Mm, look how strong they are. Oh, look at that. Uh huh. Uh huh. Those are women. Those are not women, are they? Those are women. Look no. At how small their bodies are. Maybe they're like, oh, you know what? They probably are like practicing. Maybe because there's nothing going on there. Are they practicing? Maybe, but. Mm -hmm. Do your thing, you sexy fireman, you. <laughs> Anyways, this is my gel Manny. I have the same color on my toes. I always get the same color. I don't like to get different colors. But I used to get acrylics, but they're so bad for my nails and for my skin around my nails. So I stopped. So now I just get gel Mannies and Petties with my real nails. And I'm starting to like my natural short nails. So especially when it's done when I get a manicure when I do it myself it doesn't look good but when you get it done when you actually get it done it actually makes it look good so just wanted to get one last look of the gifts under the tree because I am going to be separating the gifts because um, we are not going anywhere on Christmas we are staying home with my mom and had and having our own Christmas here with her we usually go to uh my auntie's house and mike's side of the family but this year we're not um, we're spending the holidays at home with my mom so um i gotta sort these gifts out and i am dropping them off to the Pereira side which is my dad's side and the austria side which is mike's side so that they have their gifts on christmas so i gotta go through all these gifts and do that. I will show you guys the separated gifts when I do it. So this is what it's come down to. This is um, all for my mom's side of the family, just the kids, and for Nathan, Nolan, my mom, me, and Mike. So those are the gifts that are left under the tree. And then over here, this is the Austria side, which is Mike's side. I'm gonna drop those off and then this is the Pereira side, which is my dad's side, all my little cousins, aunties, uncles, grandma, right here. So, yeah. So everything's separated. Now, time to put them in bags so that I could 
drop them off tomorrow and be like Santa Claus. Oh, also what's left under are gifts for our friends' kids and some of our friends. Um, we are doing our holiday party with them after the new year um, because our scheduling is just off. Like we can't all get together at the same time. So the only time we can get together is next year. Um, the first week of 2019, we're getting together to do our holiday party. Other can opener broke. It was one of those cheapy, well, I guess it's not a cheap brand, but it's, you know, the regular can openers that open like um, from right here, the inside. I'll show you what I'm talking about. But this one I got here at Best Buy and it was pretty pricey. It was almost $50 for this, guys. But you know what? So worth it. And I'm going to show you why. So hold on a okay, second. So I'm going to show you why I love it. It's gonna stop on its own. Okay, that's done. I'm gonna put this down so I can show you. Undo it. And then look. No sh no sharp edges. It comes it it cuts it open from right here as opposed to you know the other ones where it goes right here and then it has like sharp edges. This has no sharp edge. As you can tell, I'm putting my finger around it. Oh my goodness, guys, I love it. And it's not so loud. Um, it just cuts it. Oops. It just cuts it perfectly right on the side. This is corned beef, by the way. So it really does, it's really worth it if you do pay extra for something. Now, this one is almost $50, which I think is too much for a can opener because I know there are like some that are for like $15, $20, which is the one that we had before, but it broke. And this better brand or quality is so much better. And I do not regret spending that much on a can opener.